Hello, this is Susie. I am making another video for you guys, something easy. Uh, if your parents are too busy, uh, that you guys can do this all by yourself in the microwave. And in the microwave, we are going to be using different ingredients like elbow pasta, water, milk, um, different types of cheeses. If you have a Colby cheese or a cheddar cheese or even um, butter and a pinch of salt. That's all you need with a bowl um, and a few measuring uh, cups and tablespoons and you are on your way. What it says to do first is um, get your bowl and you are going to pour one and a half cups of water into it. Once you have that, you're going to take your half a cup of either elbow noodles. I have little mini uh, shells that I'm going to use instead. Do that. And then we're going to take it and we're going to put it in the microwave for four minutes. Once it's um, making and baking in the uh, microwave, it'll steam. Um, once we're done, we are going to uh, take the microwave bowl out carefully. Um, you should get some mitts so you don't burn yourself. Uh, also, you might want to get a strainer um, to empty uh, the noodles in out of the bowl so that uh, once everything is al dente, al dente uh, that you can then proceed with the rest of the ingredients, um, which is I use a cheddar Colby and um, some milk, some butter, and uh, some salt. So it's not very di difficult. It usually should take a couple minutes to make, nothing crazy. Um, so we have our boiled mac and cheese or ma uh, macaroni anyway. What we're gonna do next is we're gonna add some of the cheese into the bowl. Um, you're also gonna take a tablespoon of butter to help everything along. Um, maybe also add a pinch of salt. Um, and a tablespoon of milk. Make it creamy. Once you have all that in, add the rest of your cheese, and um, then you can stir it up, mash it all up, and with the hot um, hot noodles, without the water in them, will start melting all of the cheese and the butter and. It'll get creamy. Once you have it mixed pretty well, it says to uh, put it in the microwave for 30 seconds. Those 30 seconds are gonna melt everything, heat it all up one more time, and bring it to the end. Um, you may also add uh, vegetables to it. You can add uh, bacon. You can add, um, some people like, um, oh God, lots of different things in your, whatever you kind of like in your mac and cheese, add it. Um, or just keep it simple, keep it plain. Mac and cheese is always good. Okay. So we are going to stir it up one last time and get everything covered in the ooey gooey cheese. And that's our mac and cheese. Enjoy. Bye.